Hello guys, welcome back to a brand new video and welcome back to Premier League predictions Week 36 of the Premier League predictions Just two weeks left of the Premier League Predictions for week 36, few results going Maybe it's slightly against the odds where it's been one team relegated But guys, a lot to get through so guys, let's get straight down to it Guys, you know what to do, subscribe for more Thanks for watching and let's go So the first thing is Chelsea versus Norwich. Norwich has already been relegated. So this game for Norwich has no real aspect. Chelsea, we're still fighting for the top four. This could be one of them games that goes slightly against the odds, but do I go with it? I am actually. I'm going to predict Norwich to pick up their first three points in quite a while. And I'm going to go for a 1-0 Norwich win. My next one is Burnley versus Wolverhampton. Burnley are one of them teams that did draw to Liverpool this weekend. Wolverhampton has had a bit easy over Everton in my expectations. So this game is going to be one or two sort of ways. I'm going to go probably with... A win, and I'm gonna go with a two-nil Wolves win. My next one is Manchester City versus Bournemouth. Now, as I'm recording this, and you will see it after this game, but as I'm recording it, Bournemouth is still yet left yet to play. Man City, you know, beating Brighton five nil. Well done, City, for doing that. This game could be a really must-win game for Bournemouth. But no matter which way the result goes against Leicester, I can't see Bournemouth winning it. So I'll go for another 5 now Manchester City win. My next one is Newcastle versus Spurs. Newcastle are one of them teams that you know have their good days and their bad days, same as anyone else really. Spurs beating Arsenal 2-1 in the North London derby. Uh, yeah, great win for Spurs. <laughs> I don't know what to say about that, but yeah, good win for Spurs. This game, I can see it going one way. I'm going to call it a draw, and I'll go for a one all scoreline for that one. My next one is Arsenal versus Liverpool. Now... Arsenal, as I said, lost to Tottenham. Liverpool drawing to Burnley. This game could have a bit more than just the friendly uh, rivalry to it. Arsenal are obviously now near the Premier League. Liverpool done it. Obviously, but still not yet Premier League champions. Obviously, they don't put the title up to the end of the season. And I think that might be next week for the Hawks' last time game. But, as far as this game goes, I'm going to go for a Liverpool win. And I'm going to go for a 3-0 Liverpool win. My next one is Everton versus Aston Villa. Big win Russell Villa against Crystal Palace. Everton losing to Wolves. This is another must-win game for Aston Villa. Obviously, what I would love to see is Villa first West Ham when it takes it all. It could still happen, but Villa do have to win this game. Do I predict to do it? No. I'm going to go with an Everton win, and I'm going to go for a 1-0 Everton win. My next one is Leicester versus Sheffield United. Leicester, yeah, playing Bournemouth, as I said, Tommy Sirius, you would know that result anyway. Sheffield United are one of them teams that are going to say it like Wolves. They came into the Premier League, they took it by storm, fair play, Sheffield United. How do I see this game planning out? I think it's going to be a very tight, very cagey. A draw, and I'm going to go for a nil-nil scoreline for that one. My next one is Crystal Palace versus Manchester United. 
Crystal Palace are, you know, losing to Villa. But they're going up against a very, very decent Man United team. Very decent indeed. So, what, what, what way do I call this one? Obviously, I'm only going to call it one way. Man United win by three goals to one. My next one is Southampton versus Brighton. Southampton, you know, beating City uh, a couple of weeks back or a week back, whatever you want to call it. Coming up against a Brighton team that have just literally come back from playing two tough teams. One Liverpool, one Man City. Then on the back of that Liverpool game, they play Man United. This is a game where Brighton can pick up some points. I'm not going to put them down to get all three, but I'm going to put them down to a draw, and I'm going to put them down for a one-on scoreline for that one. Now, this game will probably go on my week 37, but it's not say week 36 fixture. It's Watford versus West Ham. West Ham, after that Villa win, is a must must win for West Ham. Yet again, on the other hand, with that Villa win, it's a must, must win game for Watford. What way do I call this one? Easy, draw, lots of goals, a 2-2 scoreline for that one. But anyway, guys, you know what to do. You should have a big fat thumbs up if you enjoy it. Subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. Shelf down.